Hey everybody, Glenn Trayer, Mountain Man Journals. Um, I guess there's been some confusion a little bit on what the purpose of my fire piston, the whole setup is, um, the fire part. Um, some people aren't sure exactly what, how you create the fire with this tool. Um, and I'm going to show you how to do that today. Um, I'm going to be using the, the multi-flame tool uh, mini, um, but it'll work with the multi-flame tool. Um, it's the same function, the same same thing, um, same way of getting your fire fire started. So I'm just using you know the mini here. Um, what I do is I got my bird's nest here. Um, this is just old man's beard, uh, lichen, and um, some pine nettles. And I put a little bit of charred cloth in here, a little extra to help it um, stay, uh, prolong it till you get it blown to life. Um, what you do is uh, you take, and, and like I showed in uh, my other video on the functions of this, um, is you can take this uh, this o-ring on here and you can either you need to you should lubricate it one way or the other to help create a seal um, you can either spit on it you know spit in your hand and rub it in there or I use uh, the um, this lip balm that my wife made uh, it's really good for like cuts and, and stuff like that um, but uh, or you can use uh, like gun oil or you know stuff like that it works works good Vaseline but you just smear that on the uh, o-ring go right around the whole the whole o-ring smear it up good now what you do what you do is uh, you take um, char cloth you just take some char cloth and you uh, tear tear a piece of it off you get a good little hunk of it and you place that char cloth into the end here right above the o-ring forcing that down in there get a good chunk of it in there and kind of cut the edges off push it down now all you do is you take and, and you Place that into the end of the um, shaft, right like such. You can see how it slides slides in there. Place that in there. Now, before you do that, you want to have a, a knife or something um, that you can get that char out of the end there. There is a slot on the side here that allows you to get the uh, char out um, placing the knife in there and pushing the char out into your bird's nest um, now I guess what you do here is uh, you just place it in there and you just slam it down boom you've got fire you place that into your bird's nest well, pull it out a little bit hopefully you can see that smoke coming up and you place that in next to your char that you already have in your bird's nest. Place these off to the side. And you put that. Squeeze your bird's nest together. Place this on the ground, it's getting a little hot there. And 
and there you go. You have fire. <laughs> Let this uh, smoke clear a little bit for you. And uh, that's that's how your fire piston works. Um, you just place in that char right into the end there, and uh, stick it in in there, and just slam it down. And what that does is it acts right like a um, a diesel engine does. Um, it creates uh, pressure in there, and it combusts the char under pressure um, that uh, actually reaches between like 300 350 and 500 degrees down in um, down in there so um, that's what causes the uh, ignition of your char in the end there you can use um, other things out in the, the wilderness to get um, to get that going um, but I I will say it's hard. It's very hard to do. Um, I've used all kinds of different stuff, and you can do it. Yes, you can. But it's hard. It's I mean, uh, if you don't have the perfect thing, it's 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 real hard. Um, so hopefully you guys understood that okay, and uh, I answered some questions on how you. Uh, how do you use the fire part of the um, fire piston? Um, and uh, hopefully uh, you'll uh, go and, and purchase yourself one of these. Again, we used the mini, um, but the function of starting the fire is the exact same on the uh, the, the large one, um, the uh, multi-flame tool, as it is the mini. Uh, it's the same same function to get your fire started so uh, well guys hope uh, you got something out of that and uh, you um, enjoyed uh, enjoyed this video and uh, hopefully you'll go uh, get something out of this or go go buy one of these and um, I guess uh, hopefully everybody's doing well out there and I guess with that being said fellas take care God bless and we'll see you on the next one take care